So if you are interested in learning how to get out of debt, build financial wealth, or just be in a better place so that you can beat this inflation, this economy, then I want you to definitely stay tuned, watch this short video, and I'm going to show, show with you what one of my secrets is in order to build wealth and be able to be in a better financial position. So one of the things that I would recommend is, first and foremost, if you found this video helpful, make sure that you stay tuned and watch this video all the way to the end, because this information, it really could change your life if you allow it to. So one thing I would tell you when it comes to um, finances and money is that you have to be financially literate, literate now more than ever, especially in this economy. Uh, and so a lot of people are worried and scared and you're thinking about inflation and, and et cetera. And there's honestly a mindset shift that you have to have if you want to be successful in your finances. So regardless of how little or how much you have right now, if you begin to learn financial literacy and read, you know, read, watch videos, change your daily habits, you will be in a better position than most people, right? So that way you can be okay. So aside from, you know, working and making money, which is another video, honestly, one of the things that I recommend is something called um, infinity banking or becoming your own bank. When I first heard this, this term, I thought it was silly. I didn't think it was legit or real until I began to read books on it and begin to learn what it really means. And so becoming your own bank, bank in fact, I'll put it in the comments so that we can see what I'm talking about. Um, so becoming your own bank is literally where, you know, typically when you go to the bank, what happens when you want to go to the bank? You want to get financing for like a car or a home or some type of product or equipment that you may need. What do you have to do? You have to go to the bank, right? If they get a loan, if they approve it, if you get the loan, it will affect and may affect, well, it will usually affect your credit score. And then um, on top of that, they're going to charge you interest rates and fees as well. Um, and so then you'll get the loan. And hopefully you'll be able to maximize whatever it is that you bought. And typically because you're going through the bank, you are going to pay more than if you had the cash up front, right? Like you're gonna always gonna pay more because they're gonna charge you fees to borrow their money. So the concept of becoming your own bank means that you essentially create your own banking system. And instead of you having to borrow money from the bank or other sources, you're literally borrowing money from yourself. And then from there, you're able to build wealth because now you don't have to depend on, on financing from other places. Um, it's the same thing that I've done in order to uh, buy things like, for example, going to the dentist. You know, when you go to the dentist, if you can't afford to pay the, the whole thing up front, what they will do, they will say, okay, you can go through our financing, right? For your root canal, that's $1,600 or whatever. And so then what will happen is that you'll apply through their financing program, just an example, and then they'll charge you interest rates and fees and you'll be paying for that thing forever. And usually you're paying more than whatever you took out. So instead, when you become your own bank, you borrow from your own bank essentially, and you're never going to pay more interest rates and it's not going to affect your credit score and you're still going to be building wealth at the same time. So another term for this is what you call buying whole life in the whole life cash value insurance policies. And so when you buy whole life insurance cash value policies, you're able to not only, of course, leave a legacy in the event something bad happens, but at the same time, you're able to build cash value. The money that your, your the cash value in your whole life policy uh, um, appreciates, it's not taxed. Um, it's the way that literally uh, a lot of uh, people that are in high positions have been able to build massive wealth 
and not be taxed for it because they hide the, the money in their whole life insurance policies. So once I really, it took me a while to understand the concept, to be honest, but once I really understood it, I realized, okay, this is what people are doing. This is what the wealthy people are doing, is that they are investing whole life policies and then building up their policies and then using that as their own banking system in order to build massive amount of wealth no matter how little you may have today. So what I want to do right now, I myself, I'm actually also, in addition to being a registered nurse, in addition to being a content creator, in addition to being an entrepreneur, everything I do, et cetera, I'm also a licensed um, life insurance agent, okay? Yes, I know. Yeah, I do that too because I'm, a, I'm passionate about many things. So if you want to get in on this, I have a partner that you can, um, I have a partner actually that will help you through this process. So it's somebody that I trust completely. And because he has helped me get started and he has paid off exponentially. So if you wanna learn more, if you wanna get started and you wanna learn how to create your own whole life insurance policy, go ahead and just check below this video. Uh, if you click below, you can go ahead and put in your name and email address in the form. It will say, sign up here. Uh, put your name, email, um, and some contact information, and then we'll be able to contact you and get you started, fill you in a little bit, some more, educate you a little bit some more, so that way you can be a part of this amazing opportunity. I promise you, it's totally legit. It's not anything bad. It's something that um, even, for example, banks, like Bank of America, when you put your money in their, um, in, your, in their bank, right, and you get... 0.00000%. What they do is that they take your money, okay, that you gave them, and then they put into these whole life policies, um, and then they make money, more money back, and that's how they make money on your money. And then they charge you 23%, 26% interest rate, right? That's what the banking banks are doing. But now, because you're learning financial literacy, you're going to be able to flip the script, right? And if you want to learn more about this, there's also books on Amazon. Or you can, it's called, you know, becoming your own bank. Um, I'm trying to think what else, another term for it. But essentially, if you look up the word becoming your own bank, you can also read about it. There's several books that will teach you more about this concept. But if you want to get started and learn how to create your own policy, um, or, or sorry, how to get your own policy, et cetera, then comment below and check the description below so that way you can sign up. Uh, so that way we can contact you and be able to help you with this process, all right? Thank you for watching. Go ahead and subscribe or like and follow. If you know somebody that will um, benefit from this, then definitely share this video with them. All right, take care, and I'll see you the next time. And make sure you tune into our next videos if you find this stuff helpful.